really hungry. Geronimo said, I need food. And then everybody else said they wanted food too. So I said, what do you want to eat? And they said, I bought some Mexican food. And we said, okay, let's go. So we had to run out of town and get some. We just got to figure out which one they want. You got any idea where we are? That's my house. Actually, I got a castle in Brooklyn. That's where I dwell, but I've told you that before. So we got a couple of choices. You want to do the Mad Me Ikan? Is that what that says? The Mad Me Ikan or somewhere else. Okay. They're not sure they want the Mad Me Ikan. So we're going to go down to the gourmet as we go I've actually got some roots in this town small roots out of this yeah I think we're gonna go to the redneck gourmet I'm not sure yet I don't know that barbecue place is smelling good as it comes up the <laughs> the street doesn't that smell good make your nose water okay so the decision has been made we're gonna go to the mad me ikan and then we're gonna go back over there and look at some other stuff <laughs> you know what ea jr just said <laughs> he said you're gonna get demonetized because he was just singing a song <laughs> and it sounded so good <laughs> I've always wondered if that was actually possible. I don't know. Here we are. We're about to jet head out. <laughs> what their promise. We did it. We just had the mad me icking. We're done. So now we are going over here to look for ice cream somewhere. I'm not sure where. Can we shop somewhere? By now you've probably figured out where we are. Oh wait, there's a... Uh, rock salt. Rock salt. Rock salt. No. Bar. I think we're gonna go over here and go around that side and read all the tops of buildings. So there's the gourmet redneck. I wish we had went there, although our Mexican food was good. So we're gonna go. Let's go this way and look for food. See that place up there says CF Meyer. I don't see a date on it though. At the top. Check that out. I was looking for a date on it somewhere, which it may be on a sign somewhere. But I don't know for sure. That's a concrete ball. I'm looking for dates on the top of the buildings. I'm trying to teach the offspring that sometimes there's dates on the top. There's probably a date. Hmm. So Geronimo wants to go look at records. Where's records? Yeah, let's go. Vinyl. Where do you see vinyl? On the door. Oh, okay. At the. I want to go over and look at that old church and check it out. Ron's that. Geronimo got her a Jethro record player. Mm. And she has thrown away her phone. Okay, maybe not. I don't know who any of these people are. Here you go. Here's Oh, honey. Your lips are red from drinking that. I they were always Amy, red. what you want to do? Is that the right one? It's the only song I know sure, by them. I, I think we're going to go and look around. Who is that? That must be a, something about boats. All right, y'all tell me if you know these. 
Chicago. Don't know, don't know. Oh yeah, Andy Gibb. There's Andrew. Never heard of that. Yeah, I've never heard of most of these. Uh, this one, I knew all these. No way. Gary Manilow. That's like a disease, Uriah. What's wrong? I got the Uriah heap. Let's go in here and see what's going on. Where'd they go? Oh, they're over here looking at records on the other side. So we're gonna go check them out. This is a pretty neat store. Check it out. My bride's over there checking out a, uh, who is that? Oh, that's the, uh, oh, that's the whammy lammy, uh. <laughs> Back outside, noon and places and faces. That's Robin Williams. We need to get a better view. You know, I may have shown y'all, but have I brought y'all here before? I can't remember. If we have been here or not. Okay, Geronimo made a purchase. It is... That's the dude off Stranger Things. Oh, that's the guy off the... Uh, community. That dude. Superstore? Superstore. Here you go, Geronimo. Let's go. <laughs> okay, E wants to look at this building down here. Y'all remember E? Y'all supported him a few years ago to go to a uh, camp for kids with diabetes. He's a lot bigger now. He's growing up. He's getting his groove on. So I'm checking out the songs. What's some options here? Oh, they're all on the front. Sorry, that's the hard rock version. Where's the building? Oh, there it is. Here's your album drama. George, can I look at the music? Oh yeah, this place is cool. So what is it? It is... Oh, this is CBC. Not to be confused with the center of beer control. This is the Central Baptist Church. Yeah, this place is beautiful, isn't it? Actually, a little moss garden is cool. Let me tell you why. I don't know if you know it, but there's a thing that grows out of these. And they're called British soldiers, I believe. You ever seen those before? Mm -mm. It grows in a moss and it's they got little red tips on them. I don't know if that's what these are or if that's what they were attempting to do, but the only reason I know that's because I Googled it. Wow, 1897. A long time ago. Oh, this place was built in 1897. There is the cornerstone of this building anyway. It's pretty nice. You almost see sunglasses look at it so bright. It looks like it's been added onto. I mean, obviously it has, but they did a great job matching. I wonder if that and this marble is from Silicaga. Although North Georgia has some, uh, is known for its marble, I believe. So we're gonna head across the street. This way. Go away. They did that. If you have ever watched, what was the name of that show? The Men Who Made or Built yeah, America? If you ever watched that show, it is pretty awesome because it talks about Carnegie. You know, Carnegie was in a battle with someone else about Steel Rockefeller, I believe. And if I'm wrong, it really doesn't matter right now because I'm just telling you the story. But it's neat. It says this library is a gift of Andrew Carnegie. I wonder why it doesn't say from. 
It doesn't matter either. Why you gotta be picky? So check it out. Pretty cool, huh? Still making our way around. There's a uh, courthouse back home, and at the top is the legal symbol thing. The little statue. I don't know what that one is, but this is a trip around the square. <laughs> what do you smile about? <laughs> Do I think what? You didn't even go to the top of that. This pole? No, that building. Yeah, you want to go up there? Yeah. We can That's try it. Much. You can. That is Fanta on his lips. It's uh. I did not put lips. He did not put lipstick on. <laughs> so what is it? They just busted up in there. We're about to go check it out. See, there's another awesome church over there. Murray Warehouse Block, 1895. So much to do, so much to see. Let's go check it out. I guess you can. Oh, yeah? Oh, check it out. What is that? That's the old block. That's the camera from here? Uh-huh. What is this for? That thing actually has a little electric motor on it. A Leland motor to be exact. Which is pretty cool. Good morning Vietnam. That's what it makes me think of. Remember the movie? I can't read that. This place is pretty cool. There is a basement in the Allen <laughs> mode. What did you hear? I forgot hear? that you watched that one. Mate. Yeah, what is that from? This is actually a restaurant. Was it a restaurant and a bar or just a restaurant? I don't remember. That's oh, pretty neat though. Here. Why? I thought it was a rock. He tried to pick up a piece of gum because he thought it was a rock. That's not lipstick. It is strawberry Fanta. Okay, we're good now. So we're crossing the road. So we're gonna go look, see what's on the other side of the square. Here comes the people of the neighborhood. Right there. Here's something you can Google. C.F. Meyer, Noonan, Georgia. Are you going to do it, E? Give us a little history on C.F. Meyer, Noonan, Georgia. See, there's a building, 1894. All right, C.F. Meyer, what'd you get? He's checking it. This is a nice little town square. Did you find anything yet? What shade lipstick is that? What was it? It was just a grocery store? That's what they built it as. Huh. Well, let's do another one. Look at that on the corner. Oh yeah, a little truck. Yeah, can we go over there and take a picture? Yeah, let's go. This is a parklet. Okay, we got the... Uh... That place we went was really good. I kind of wish we had fed there. Only because Alan Jackson is on the side. I'm going to show it to you. Did you get over here? Painted red, stripe was white. The rune could sing that song when he was about three. From beginning to end. Okay, three, four, five. Every word. All right, I'm looking for more building dates. I don't see any. I'm looking, so we're gonna go down here and see if. Oh, no, it says it's open. Oh, it's about to be owned like a chicken wing. I think is the way the saying goes. 
I don't know if I don't want, I want ice cream cookies, moss, milkshakes, floats, sundaes, or what? I'm thinking so. And then I think we're gonna go over there and see what's going on at the barbecue shack. Yeah, here we go. It's on now. Okay, got a slot. Oh, they got a bicycle on the ceiling too. There's my bride. They're they're ordering. They're getting ready. We're gonna go up here and feed. There is a massive amount of children in here. It's pretty cool. What'd you get? Oh, you got like a little Holly Hobby colors. I got this little bit here. Mine's like a keg of ice cream. E, what'd you get? Cookies and cream. Hmm. What'd you get? Nothing. Okay. What'd you get, darling? So we're done. We're finished. We're making it outside the rock side hallway and we're gonna go out here and turn right see my bride went. There she is. I'm trying to remember the name of this place. It is called Rock Salt Milk Bar. And all this we got was only like 20 bucks. Which is amazing because we went to this horrible place where they beat this ice cream on a table on marble. What was that marble place called? Wasn't it ice cream and marble? We spent like a hundred dollars for us. It was horrible. He, he always wants to show me stuff. We're done. I think we're leaving. It, that bird almost hit me in the head. We've done the whole square. We've done food. We've done walking. We're doing a little driving. And crying. I forgot what parked by him. That's pretty sweet. I wonder how Alan's doing these days. I'm sure he asked about me. Absolutely world's best voice on a country music singer. We're done. Say bye to Noonan. Thanks for going along with us on this trip. Thanks for watching my video. So we're not done. We're going to go over there and I'm going to show you all something. We push the baton and it should be about our turn here in a minute and we're going to go check it out. Oh, I ate too much. Do they have like a microphone? Mm -hmm. I have a, that my burrito weighed about two pounds and my ice cream weighed about a pound and uh what about your liquids oh yeah another pound of liquids so uh i ate a lot so we're gonna go look i'm just gonna let y'all listen for a minute That's the first there's many more in that. But I know you're not that he wasn't that smart. And when I was young, I used to have a long time. But as I got older, I see what he was doing. And it was a shame that I would have to go before the city council and act like I'm stupid in order to make change. There's a pool over there on Richard Allen Drive and Dr. Street. They were gonna close that down. We got 600 signatures. I'm not going door to door, we really were really work. But guess what? There's a pool over there <laughs> on Dr. <Dockham> Street. <clears throat> Ruthia School, the only the first black elementary school in Cuyahoga County was church school before then. The United States got a host of it. Went before the school board, we fought, we fought. But guess what? Roof Hill is still over there. Yeah. But what I'm trying to say, don't let these people that got murdered, I'm going to call it nothing but murder. Murder, let their life go in vain. Don't let Dr. King's life go in vain. You know, going to the uh, Dr. King bar chair, I'm kind of mixed on it. We might talk the dream, but we don't live the dream no more. In order to form a more perfect union, 
is that, in fact, I talked to my, my boy, he's, he's a Hebrew Israelite. I'm not a Hebrew Israelite, <clears throat> but he's smart. And we talked about Kemish and uh, Moors and all that stuff. You know that there have been many, since the beginning of the time, there have been many different uh, groups, uh, ethnicities, that have been in control of the world. And we are wondering if it is time for America to step back. <clears throat> but I believe unless we pay homage and admit that it's been wrong in America, the way you did the black man, not only us, the Native Americans, the uh, uh, Spanish, and even the uh, community that are uh, uh, the home. It's a reggae song, and I would drive right down the street where they had all the, uh, the uh, government that was stolen. Sometimes I would go in the evening. When I come down that street with all them kips on, get up, stand up, stand up for you, right? Some people, black lives matter. But uh, that's what I'm saying is, in wars, I come, some people can go for, uh, for, uh, uh, the vice president. And it reminds me of when, uh, when uh, uh, last time we went. Uh... I just want to show you a little piece of a peaceful, not necessarily a protest, but a reminder that all people are created equal. And this is uh, at Noonan, so it's pretty awesome. We talked, we got a chance to stop and talk to several people. Everybody's really nice. I just kind of had enough. So now, thanks for watching my videos.